Lose weight and save the planet simply by changing one meal a day? That's what our next guest says. She's a mom of five, actress, environmentalist, and now author. The book is called OMD, Changing the World by Changing One Meal a Day. Please welcome Susie Amos Cameron to the show. <laughs> welcome. Thank you. So just out of the gate, want to ask what the inspiration was to, to write this book. So my husband, James Cameron, and I watched a documentary called Forks Over Knives. And we learned all about the devastating effects on your health. And we basically blew up our kitchen. We, were, we went plant-based within 24 hours. But we realized that that's not for everyone. So my husband, if you know him, he's, his movies, Titanic, Terminator, and Avatar, He's kind of a doomsday kind of guy. <laughs> yeah, you're probably right. And he does not use the word hope. He even has a t-shirt that says, hope is not a strategy. And he wears it. So about three months after we went plant-based, we were walking on the beach. And he turned to me and he said, you know, babe, for the first time in my life, I have hope. Needless to say, I almost fell down in the surf. <laughs> but he said, the more people we can get to eat plant-based, the more we can move the needle on climate change. So it's great for your health, it's great for the environment, it's great for the animals, it's great for your waistline, and it's great for your sex life, too. Yeah, we don't want to hear any stories about that. Oh, come on! <laughs> you know, we, the school that I founded, Muse School, with my sister, Rebecca Amos, we are the first plant-based school in the nation and when we decided to go plant-based, it was full-on mutiny. We lost 50% of our families. I mean, we've since regained our enrollment and we've surpassed it. And um, we now have families moving from all over the country to come to the school because it's plant-based. Wow. And yeah. what do the kids think? You know, we've... Well, we, didn't, we had to deal with the parents first. And our head of school got very frustrated one day and he said, now listen, folks, it's, you don't have to give up your favorite foods. You can feed them eggs and bacon in the morning, and you can feed them a burger at night. It's just one meal a day for the planet. It's OMD. So that's where OMD was born. Really quickly, Susie, can you break down a few options? So you here have a bagel, and typically you would use cream cheese, but this is a Nut-based alternative? Nut-based cream cheese, yeah. Okay. So, so th that's a perfect thing to do for breakfast. And what I do with my kids, and I've, you know, and I've got teenagers now too, what I find is they will eat more things if they're cut up into bite-sized pieces. And I actually, even for my teenagers, I use these kinds of things. So I've, I very often will just use regular toothpicks with cut up vegetables or with a dipping sauce or fruit. And they will eat more of these vegetables and fruits if they've got something fun to eat it with. And then I've got cocktail picks. So we've got one with a little horsey on it and a flamingo and chopsticks. So we've got these really fun little <laughs> chopstick guys. <laughs> but if you don't want to go and buy something, you can actually take a piece of paper and a rubber band and you can create great chopsticks for your toddler. Um, so ma I'm making it fun, and, and we are out of time, but I, I want to just highlight what you see here, and these are burritos and pasta, but I love that you have the black bean right. over here, the chickpeas, because what you're getting there is you're getting plant-based protein and fiber, so good for your health. Susie's book is called OMD, Changing the World by Changing One Meal a Day. Thanks so much for coming. We really appreciate it.